Make your own headlines. Hey, this is Dal Welsh, and next up is some random news to help you make the grace of God your biggest headline of the day. Today's podcast is sponsored by Ross's Harmonica Showroom and the letter L. So have you ever seen a strange face at the beach? I'm not talking about bumping into the Stork Brothers, Egg and Clay, over in Nantucket. No, when the tide is just right at Brighton Beach in Brooklyn, you can see faces in the rocks on the shore. Back in the 1970s, two brothers and their friends started sculpting faces on the rocks just to pass the time. Some people sit on those rocks and never even see the faces. One of those brothers grew up to be a sculptor, and he recently said that paintings will perish, but stone will last. You know the best part of having a sculpture of a boat? It's always ship shape. A couple of months after Jesus ascended into heaven, Peter and John were arrested. During their trial, they said this to the council. Jesus is the stone that was rejected by you. Jesus was right there. Not just his face, but all of him. His teaching, his miracles, his power, his death, his resurrection— Jesus was and is the cornerstone of God's kingdom, but the religious leaders missed him. And we can miss him too, but we don't have to. Right now, we can embrace Jesus instead of rejecting him. And what happens when we don't miss Jesus? Well, someone put it like this. In Christ, the sting of missing out is eternally gone. So if you're ever in Brighton Beach, look for the faces in the rocks. And if you're facing something difficult, turn to Jesus. He is the ultimate cornerstone, and his kingdom will last forever. And in him, you will never miss out. Make that one of your headlines today. Make Your Own Headlines is a little smidge of encouragement from Holland Avenue Baptist Church. Tune in Monday to Friday wherever you listen to podcasts. And for more positive resources, search Holland Avenue on YouTube or Apple Podcasts or visit hollandavenue.com.